Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to import the Character Creator 3 avatar into Unreal Engine 5.0.1. For today, this is the latest version, Unreal Engine 5.0.1, and make the 3D avatar to become the main avatar or any of the NPC in your Unreal Engine 5 game project. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. Alright, first, I'm going to open the Character Creator 3. Alright, Character Creator 4, sorry. That is the Character Creator 4, the latest version. Right now, Character Creator 4 already open. We also call it call this as the CC4. I close this. And first I'm going to use one of the avatar here, the CC4 avatar. So I will choose from template under the actor character cloth. Right. As demo, I'm going to use CC4 Camilla. Camilla 1. Right. Once the character already loaded, you have to open your icon it. The icon it. Right. Icon it already opened. I just close this. And next, from the character creator for here, click file, export, send to icon. Send to iClone. Alright, now it is loading this avatar into iClone 8. Alright, done. Next, you must make sure that you already install the iClone Unreal Life link. This is one of the plugins, the iClone Unreal Life link. So, if I add here, next, open the Unreal Engine 5. This is my Epic Game Launcher. Open the Unreal Engine 5.0.1 and click Launch. Because I want to start from beginning, create a new fresh project. Create a new project and show you step by step. This is a game developing tutorial, the game dev. Alright, the Unreal Engine 5 already loaded. I'm going to create a new game project here. I will create a Third person avatar, eh, sorry, the third person game project here. And then the project location will be at here C user, user document, Unreal project. The project name as demo, I'm going to name this project as, as the CC4 to UE5, Unreal Engine 5, demo 01. Right, I click create. Now it is creating. A new project. Now this game project already loaded. Right, this is the Unreal Engine 5 third person game project. If you try to play, this is the this is the main avatar of your game project. And we are going to make the CC4 avatar to be the main avatar and also the NPC in the game. I'm going to show you step by step. Right, you can see now this project name already created. And what you're going to do is back to icon, back to icon 8. Close the icon Unreal Life link first. And then click the plugin, Unreal Life link. Find the Life link plugin folder. Click into that. And then here you can see icon Life link plugin for Unreal Engine 5. Now I minimize the icon 8. I minimize the CC4. Now focus at here. The icon Life link. Plugin for Unreal 5. Next, right click the file explorer, enter the document folder. In your document folder, you should be able to see that there is an Unreal Projects folder. Double click in and find your project's name. Your project's name, and just now I put it as the CC4 to Unreal Engine 5 demo 01. This is my project's name. Double click into this folder. Next, in Icon Live Link plugin for Unreal 5.0. Double click in. 
then copy the plugin folder and then paste into here right click paste now next you can close this window and back to your icons it go to the plugin and then go to the character creator and icon auto setup and then click browse the file it will automatically pop up at, at here then double click the unreal folder you can see the latest one is the auto setup 1.23 for unreal 5.0 right if you not yet get all of this you can just go to the plugin character creator and icon auto setup go and get the tool for unreal it is free for you to download from here so now i already have so i minimize the icon same as just now the cc4 to unreal demo 01 the project already open at there so what can i do so choose the latest one the auto setup 1.23 for unreal 5.0 i double click in and copy all of this select all and right click copy here right click paste so just copy into here then close here close this close everything next in your unreal engine 5 project that already opened you close it and open it again now i close already then i back to my epic game launcher it is automatic pop out the epic game launcher is popping out i launch it again the unreal engine 5.01 i click launch now it is launching the unreal editor the unreal Ed editor 5.0.1 and you are going to reopen the project which one is your project cc4 to unreal engine 5 demo 01 it is set here double click in now it is going to to restart the program restart the game project and now we are going to find the plugin inside here so what can you see just look at here you already have this the cc setup and you also already have the icon unreal live link so you, this two plugin already installed here now we can start if you try to play the main avada is here you escape first next you back to the icons open the plugin go to the plugins and real life link open the icon and real life link and then you can see this this avatar already selected all right so this is named as camilla so now i untick untick everything now we are going to transfer this avatar to unreal engine 5 you only want to take the, the camilla click the setting here to untick place assets in scenes you untake it we don't want it to put at the scene so now click transfer the file and make sure that in your unreal engine 5 you already opened that project that install with the cc setup and also icon unreal live link we did open it there so now you you have to wait for a while until it finish transfer now it is transferring you have to wait right now you can see the command already pop out here so it is something like this we have to wait until it finish transfer so at this moment please do not do anything in your unreal engine 5 just wait until it finish now once finished transfer ready it will automatically put your camilla avatar at here that is under content resolution content camilla that is under here and then you have to wait wait for it to preparing the shader now it is 79 percent you have to make sure that all the shader already finished loaded now if you double click in it not yet finished so you still have to wait all right just close it and wait until preparing shader finish all right now if you double click your avatar you can see that actually most of the texture already loaded and now actually we can proceed and now i don't want i don't want to wait for this already so next you have to go to the go to the skeleton double click and then at here you can see skeleton tree and repartit source you go to the window here then you take the asset detail to turn it on 
once you already can see the assets detail, then the compatible skeletons, the compatible skeletons, you can just plus here. Right now, here you have to choose the the SK Manoquin. The, the SK Manoquin skeleton, choose this one. Alright. Once you choose already, you can close it. Then save, close. Alright. Then next you are going to make it become become the main avatar or the MGC in this game. Now if you play this mana queen, female mana queen is the main avatar. Now you want to make Camilla to become your main avatar. So what can you do? You have to go to the contents, go to the third person, go to the blueprint. Now by default, the third person character blueprint is set here. You right click and duplicate it. And then you just need to delete the number one and use an underscore, name this as Camilla. Right, next, what can you do? Just double click in, go to the mesh, go to the viewport, here. The skeleton mesh, you can just choose the Camilla. Done, then compile and save. All right, mesh, viewport. The Camilla, once you choose already, you have to come back and make sure that the animation class you have to choose the ABP green. All right. You must make sure. Just compile and save. Close. This step is compulsory. Next, you can see the BP third person game mode here. You have to double click in. And then, at here, you have to, to choose the default font class here. The default font class is the main avatar. You have to make sure you choose the BP third person character Camilla. Then click compile, save, then close. Now actually, when you try to play, you can see the main avatar already, already become Camilla. Now, this CC4 avatar already become, become the main avatar in your Unreal Engine 5 game project. You also can make her become an NPC, you can just drag her out, you press E, you can rotate it. And then once you try to play, now you can see you are the main, main avatar at the same time. You can see the NPC at here. You also make Camilla become one of the NPC in your game project. And now everything already done. Yeah, this is really awesome. All right. That's all for today about how to import the character creator for 3D avatar into Unreal Engine 5.0.1 game project to make any 3D avatar to become the main avatar in your game project or make him and make her become any of the NPC in your game project. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial, if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all, so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial, you will receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy, happy animation and game developing. See you.